Alright, welcome everybody to another Microsoft Flight Simulator video where today we're going to be flying the PMDG 737 from uh, Pinto Martins to Recife in Brazil um, and we're going to be doing a cargo flight right now I've got this um, uh, Titan Airways livery uh, it's not accurate, really I should have downloaded something like an Aerosucre livery which also would allow me uh, to fly like a maniac, but eh, it is what it is. This is the livery I got. I think it looks pretty, and uh, we're going to go with it. So, let's have a quick look at our route here. So, I've got my flight plan here. Ignore the uh, FedEx stuff and Airbus A310. I was originally going to do this flight in the Airbus A310, but... Uh, uh, Recife Center, FedEx 13, sorry for all the trouble, but um, I'm gonna disconnect and come back in a different aircraft. The Airbus A310 is, uh, well, pardon my French, a piece of shit. No problem, sir, I agree. So, yeah, we're gonna do it in the 737 now. This is our route, uh, gonna be cruising at flight level 350, and uh, we are flying with Fat Sim, so we got some uh, air traffic control guiding us all the way. Recife Center, SEP 13, Boeing 737 this time around. Pinto Martin, stand 12, information Alpha, would like IRFA to receive it, please. SEP 13, Recife Center, hello again. You are clear to receive level 350, departure only 13, Lodgery 2 Alpha, Diana Transition, Squawk 5034. Flight level 350, runway 13 for departure, squawk 5034, and Lodge 2 l for departure, Diana transition. Zep 13. Zep 13, read back, is correct, call for push and start. Alright! Let's see if we can get this. Don't do that, for uh, First, let's start our APU here. Então, no 02, no autorizado, push acionamento, call da direita, chama ataque. Cala direita vai chamar táxi, então 2 0 And let's make sure that we have enough fuel and that we are fully loaded. Zap 1 3 ready for push and start. Zap 1 3 push and start, Zap facing north, can reach 1 0. One two. Push facing north and uh, QNH one zero one two seven three. Yeah, we don't have a pushback tuck, so just use your imagination. In the meantime, we can run our test. Actually, no. Let's start engine number one. We have a good engine start on number two. Same story, wait for N2 to rise to 20. And give it some fuel. Now we can quickly run our test, starting with the uh, TCAS. TCAS test pass. All good. Fire. Warning system. All good. Push is complete. Parking brake is set. And last but not least, our cockpit voice recorder. And we got a green light. All good. Both engines, good start. Engine 1 and engine 2 generators on. APU off. <clears throat> APU bleed off. Packs can come back on. Hydraulics on. Probe heat and window heat on. Our yaw damper is on. Alright, let's set our flaps. Here we go. Então, no 2-0, no contato radar, Nicolai, em subassistência, 
Sem restrição, 3-3-0, então 2-0. And we are good to go. Uh, well, quickly check our flight controls here. Elevators are good. Ailerons respond good. And rudder all good. Zap one three ready to taxi. Zap 13, taxi holding point runway 13 via Alpha Bravo QNH 1012. Holding point 13 via Alpha and Bravo. Zap 13. Então, 20 no VC do cockpit por um minuto. Fecha right, a reporta de volta. Enough, just straight ahead. Sem problema. And then. Yeah, so it is a somewhat of an intersection takeoff. Alright. Let's roll. Zap 13, holding runway 13. Zap 13, cliff takeoff runway 13, wind 150 degrees, 11 knots. Cliff takeoff runway 13, Zap 13. Right, let's do our takeoff checklist. So we got our auto brakes set to RTO, uh, flaps set to five, landing lights are on, strokes are on. We got uh, takeoff clearance, and our departure is set in the FMS. Takeoff checklist complete. Spooling up. Engine stable, out throttle, armed. Take of thrust set. Zap 13, we are the contact on departure, climb unrestricted to flight level 350. Unrestricted to flight level 350, Zap 13. Pretty sure you already cleared us to 350, but uh, whatever. Alright, well. The rest uh, is going to be kind of boring, we're just going to uh, climb and cruise. So um, I'll probably cut the video here and I'll talk to you guys on the arrival. Ooh, ooh we got some uh, pretty heavy turbulence here. We just went from like 1500 feet a second on descent to zero in a matter of seconds. Right, here it comes 3000 feet. So. 2500. Yep, yeah, 2500 radar altitude. Uh, Zap 13, confirm flying Romeo Fox 011. 
Uh, yeah, we are flying to Romeo Fox 011. We just need to uh, be on an intercept heading. So if we fly straight to it, then uh, our navigation won't kick in. No problem, thank you. here and while that slows down uh, we are gonna set our auto brakes and our spoilers to arm landing lights are already on of your turbulence here. Good lord, look at it. This is going to be a fun landing. Such a safety break from assault on the zero, roughly such a freedom to the right. First notch of flaps. Então, dois anos grato, o solo foi aos quatro no táxi, sem critério, tem um ótimo dia. Táxi critério, boa, tá no dois anos. Headed this here. Zap one three clear ILS whiskey run a one eight for established. Cleared ILS uh, whiskey one eight zap one three. Uh, we'll report established. Right now we got our LNAV back. There we go. Look how much we sped up. God damn. And uh, SEP 13 here, there is some severe turbulence here on the approach. Uh, it's really bad. Thank you. God, look at that. We went from zero feet a minute to 1100 and now minus 1200 wow good thing I don't have passengers in here oh my god Jesus, look at it. Minus 2,000 almost. This is terrible. Wow. Oh, I am not looking forward to this landing. Actually getting nervous here. <laughs> really happy I'm not actually on board of this aircraft. Like, this will make everybody sick. Even the most veteran pilots will puke all over the instruments. The stall bar. Uh, Zap one three clear flight runway one eight wind uh, 
One two zero degrees six knots. Clear to land runway one eight seven one three. Alright, let's do our landing checklist here quickly. Landing gear is down, flaps are set, landing lights are on, auto brake is set, spoilers are armed. We got landing clearance, landing checklist complete. And I am definitely gonna set this aircraft up for a go around. Because I feel like we're gonna need it. Air NASA 43 requesting from cockpit 30 minutes. Confirm, uh, Air Transit uh, 43. Air Transit 43 request away from cockpit for 30 minutes. Take right. the report back. And we're gonna take it manual. It. Wish me luck here, everybody. Too bad at the moment, but look at this nose angle. God, oh, that was a hard win from the. Oh my God. Okay, I spoke too soon. It is bad. It is very bad. God, hard winds from the left. Hard winds from the right. What is going on? Surprisingly soft landing. Wow. And 80 knots, thrust reverses can come off. Step one three vacated one eight. Step one three taxi via mic stand up for discussion. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Taxi via mic uh, uh, parking and auto discretion. And thank you very much for your guidance today. Have a lovely day. Thank you. Good enough. Parking brake. Uh, oh, hello. Parking brake set. There we go. Transponder can come off. Standby. APU is running. And we can shut down our engines. Wow! And N2 is below 3. We can take our anti collision lights off. Oh, and that's it. Welcome, everybody, to the frequency. I'm going to disconnect the watch. 
All stations are rude. Oh man, he's just going offline. How lucky is that? Um, yeah, that. What's our flag? Oh, that didn't quite work out. Oh. Well, doesn't matter. Welcome everybody at Recife Airport. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the flight. It's probably going to be a longer video than I usually make, but nonetheless, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and I wish you a lovely day. See you on the next one.